Let's bring in my panel now, broadcaster Craig Foster and New South Wales One Nation leader Tanya Mihalik. Hi to you both. Thank you so much for joining yeah. us on the panel this evening. Look, let's start with this because former Australian of the Year, Rosie Batty, she's urging the New South Wales government to launch a royal commission into domestic violence as Victoria's Premier Jacinta Allen launches a DB task force and ponders tougher laws, including a public database of offenders. Tanya, look, it's been another tragic week, as we've said. Do you think we do need a royal commission now? Uh, no, I don't. Um, I think a Royal Commission um, is usually very necessary when you don't know what needs to be done, OK? You need to explore the issue and you need to talk to different groups. Uh, it's also a very costly exercise and one that takes many, many years before you end up with some recommendations. I think we need much swifter action and mm. I think you need action now. And you've hit the nail on the head here tonight, Danica, because it is about reviewing the judicial system uh, and it is the justice system that indeed failed here. There's no question of that. Uh, you cannot have a situation um, where a local court registrar is, is giving bail at $5,000 uh, to somebody um, in, in, and we know it's an alleged, there's allegations here and so forth, but you've got to remember um, there are some pretty horrific um, allegations and, and charges already up against this particular individual, mm -hmm. okay? And the idea that a local court registrar had this in their hands is is not okay. Mm. I think you, you now need to have a look at um, where was the magistrate, where were the senior magistrates, were, were they available? Um, why is it that every, you know, every couple of days or every couple of weeks and months we hear these stories time and time again? It's not just related to domestic violence. No. It's also around knife possession, knife wielding, and Absolutely. a whole bunch of assault cases where people are just put on bail. The police are doing their job, okay? Mm. We know they're putting their, uh, doing their job. They're saying no to bail. Mm. What happens, they end up in front of a judicial officer who then gives bail. Yes. So the laws are there too. We've got some pretty tough penalties already in mm. place. But do we have custodial sentences? And so I think what's really important, yes, the Premier has called for a, a, an urgent review into, into the Act itself yes. and into, uh, uh, into law reform. Yep. He's also instructed the Bail Act uh, monitoring to group to mm -hmm. do their uh, review of the operations. I don't think that's enough. Mm -hmm. I don't think a Royal Commission's necessary, but I do think uh, a parliamentary inquiry would be fitting right now yep. to actually look closer at the operations of the judicial system and why these failures are happening. Because yep. we've already got lots of um, preventative exercises out there. Yeah, you know, every school has kids, uh, people look, are speaking to children about look, the absolutely. dangers of violence and why not the education you know, there. Women. That's yes, right. Yeah. The education's there, the police are doing absolutely. their job. So what's yeah. failing us? Well, it's clearly this, I mean, the judicial system. This is the